Did you know that nearly 60% of Americans don't maintain a budget? Or that families who do are likely to save up to 30% more each year? Shocking, isn't it? But here's your chance to break from the norm and navigate the exciting journey towards financial freedom. In this series, we'll take you through simple yet effective strategies to build a family budget that really works for everyone. From engaging your kids in money management, resolving financial conflicts, to leveraging technology for savvy savings, prepare to transform your financial life. Each chapter is designed not just to educate, but to revolutionize the way you handle money as a family. Stay tuned as we dive into the nuts and bolts of creating a budget that not only saves you money, but also brings your family closer together. Ready to turn those digits into delightful savings? Let's get started. One kick off to cash flow, setting the scene for success. When it comes to managing family finances, the first step is often the hardest, getting everyone on the same page. Many believe that budgeting is restrictive, but in reality, it's the foundation of financial freedom. A budget doesn't limit your freedom, it gives you freedom. It's all about choices, says financial guru Dave Ramsey. This mindset shift is vital as you embark on creating a family budget that works for everyone. Starting with a family meeting to discuss financial goals is a powerful step. Make it fun and inclusive. Bring snacks, keep the mood light, and encourage each family member to voice what they want from the budget, be it savings for college, a family vacation, or more comfortable living arrangements. This inclusive approach not only sets the stage for cooperation, but also makes the goals more tangible and personal. Moreover, addressing common myths up front can demystify financial planning. For instance, a common misconception is that budgeting is too time-consuming. However, according to a recent survey, families who maintain a simple budget save on average 20% more than those who don't. Hence, not budgeting actually costs you more in terms of missed opportunities for saving and spending wisely. Two blueprints of a budget. Designing your financial framework. Once you've established a cooperative environment, it's time to lay down the blueprints. Start by tracking your spending for a month to see where your money goes. You might find surprises, like how small daily purchases add up. It's not just the big expenses, but often the small unnoticed ones that bleed a budget dry, notes personal finance author Elizabeth Warren. Next, categorize your expenses into needs and wants. Needs are essentials like rent, groceries, and healthcare. Wants could include dining out, entertainment, or subscriptions. This clarity helps in making informed decisions on where to cut back without feeling deprived. Set specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. Smart financial goals. A unique approach is to visualize these goals. Create a vision board or use an app to depict your financial targets. This can boost motivation and help track progress visually, which is especially engaging for younger family members. Three numbers game. Smart allocation techniques. Allocating your finances wisely is crucial. A practical strategy is the 50-30-20 rule, where 50% of your income goes to needs, 30% to wants, and 20% to savings. This method simplifies decision-making and ensures balanced spending. To make this more effective, consider automating your savings. The easiest way to save is to never see your money in the first place, advises financial expert Sue Zorman. By setting up automatic transfers to savings accounts, you're building wealth effortlessly. Unexpected expenses are inevitable, so it's important to build an emergency fund. Aim to save at least three to six months worth of living expenses. This provides a safety net and reduces stress when unforeseen costs arise. Finally, regularly review and adjust your budget. Life changes and so should your budget. This can be done during monthly family meetings where you discuss what's working and what needs tweaking. This not only keeps your financial plan relevant but also keeps everyone engaged in the financial health of the family. For Family Affair, engaging everyone in the budgeting process. Budgeting is not just for parents, it's a family affair. By involving kids early in financial discussions, you're teaching them valuable life skills. Teach your children about money, and they will thank you later, says personal finance author Ron Lieber. You can start by giving them small responsibilities, like tracking their own savings for a special purchase, which makes the concept of money management relatable and practical. For teenagers, consider involving them in the family's financial planning meetings. Let them suggest ways to cut costs or decide on family financial goals. This inclusion not only makes them feel valued, but also prepares them for their own financial independence. An interesting statistic shows that teens involved in family budgets are 15% more likely to manage their money successfully in their early 20s. Creating a reward system can also make budgeting more engaging for all. For example, if the family stays under budget for the month, 
allocate a small portion of the savings towards a family treat. This turns saving into a game and encourages everyone to contribute positively to the family's financial goals. High squashing the squabbles, conflict resolution and financial planning. Money can often be a source of tension in families. It's crucial to have a strategy for resolving financial conflicts. Start with open communication. Ensure that everyone feels heard. Listening is just as important as informing in any financial discussion, advises psychologist Dr. John Gottman. Setting ground rules for discussions, such as no interruptions or dismissive comments, can help maintain respect and openness during sensitive conversations. When disagreements arise, focus on solutions rather than problems. If there's a dispute over spending, work together to find compromises that align with your family's financial goals. It might be helpful to prioritize expenses together, deciding what's most important and what can wait. Remember, the goal is not to win an argument but to find a path forward that everyone can agree on. Sometimes bringing in a neutral third party like a financial advisor can help mediate disputes and offer unbiased advice. This can be particularly useful for larger financial decisions, such as investments or purchasing a home. They can provide professional insights that might be overlooked and help steer the conversation towards the most financially sound decisions. Six tech savvy saving digital tools to revolutionize your budget. In today's digital age, numerous tools can make managing your family budget easier and more effective. Apps like Mint or YNAB, You Need a Budget, automatically track your spending and categorize expenses, making it easy to see where your money goes each month. These tools transform numbers into insights, highlighting trends in your spending that could go unnoticed in a traditional spreadsheet. Another great digital aid is the use of alerts and notifications. Set up your banking apps to notify you when you're approaching the limit in various spending categories. This instant feedback can help prevent overspending before it happens, keeping your budget on track without constant monitoring. For families with older children, consider apps that help teach money management through practical experience. Apps like Greenlight provide children with a debit card that parents control and monitor, allowing kids to make spending decisions within set boundaries. This not only empowers them but also instills a sense of responsibility towards managing money. Incorporating technology into your budgeting process can not only simplify financial management, but also make it more accessible and appealing to all family members, regardless of their age or tech savviness. Seven Custom Cuts, tailoring your budget as life changes. Life is full of changes, and your family budget should be flexible enough to adapt. Whether it's a new baby, a job change, or an unexpected medical expense, these life events can significantly affect your financial planning. Adaptability is key to financial resilience, says personal finance expert Emily Guy Birkin. Start by reviewing your budget whenever a major life event occurs, adjusting allocations to reflect your new financial reality. For instance, if a family member gets a new job with a higher salary, it's an excellent opportunity to increase your savings contributions or pay down debt faster. Conversely, if there's a job loss, Tightening the discretionary spending and enhancing the emergency fund can provide a buffer. Regularly updating your budget ensures it remains relevant and effective, regardless of life's ups and downs. Additionally, make use of tools like financial calculators or budgeting apps that offer what-if scenarios. These can help you visualize potential changes and their impacts on your finances, making it easier to make informed decisions quickly. 8. Stretching the Dollar Creative Cost-Cutting Tactics when it comes to stretching your budget, small savings can add up to big amounts. One creative tactic is to challenge each family member to find one subscription or service each month that can be cut or downgraded. This not only saves money, but also promotes critical thinking about what's truly necessary. It's not about deprivation, it's about optimization, highlights frugality blogger Mr. Money Mustache. Another effective strategy is the use of cashback apps and rewards programs. These can turn everyday purchases like groceries and gas into opportunities to save money. By choosing products or stores that offer cash back, you can passively earn money back on expenditures you'd be making anyway. Also consider the DIY approach for things like home repairs and decor. Simple online tutorials can teach you to fix a leaky faucet or make your own curtains. Not only does this save money, but it also adds a personal touch to your home. Remember, every dollar you don't spend is a dollar saved. A simple yet powerful reminder from the Savvy Savers Handbook. Time looking ahead. Building lasting wealth and security. The final chapter of your budgeting journey is about turning today's savings into tomorrow's wealth. Start by setting long-term financial goals, like saving for retirement or your children's education. Investing may seem daunting, 
but it's a vital step towards wealth accumulation. Investing is the only way to outpace inflation and increase wealth, advises investment guru Warren Buffett. Consider setting up a diversified investment portfolio with a mix of stocks, bonds, and real estate. For families new to investing, mutual funds or exchange-traded funds, ETFs, can be a good start since they offer built-in diversification and lower risk. Additionally, taking advantage of tax-advantaged accounts like 401ks and 529 college savings plans can boost your investment's growth potential due to tax benefits. It's also wise to regularly revisit your investment strategy, especially as you reach different life stages. Adjusting your portfolio to be more conservative as you approach retirement or more aggressive while you're younger can optimize your returns and match your risk tolerance. Remember, building lasting wealth is not about quick wins, but about consistent, thoughtful investment in your family's financial future. Engaging with a financial advisor can provide personalized advice tailored to your unique circumstances, ensuring that you're making the best choices for your long-term goals.